So lab part one is asking us to do a couple of things here. Let me document that call up here again. Document is here. To program the coding for the lab. Motor will start, run at a speed of something, for five seconds. After five seconds, the program ends, motor stops, more or less. All right, let's code that. Let's code that. I need to first do these same settings every time I turn this program on. Under robot, I must make sure communication mode says USB only. And under robot, make sure platform type has 2.0 Cortex, as well as natural language project either way. Must be these or this program won't run. So to begin that program, it says motor will start. It's a start motor program. It says motor runs for five seconds. That means it's a wait command. So the motor starts and then the program waits. And then it means the next line, which is a stop motor program. So a start, a wait, and a stop. The wait says for five seconds. And this motor port is whichever motor. Oh yeah, this is coming. And if you turn this program on, it assumes you have these motors set up. So just in the habit of clearing everything out, clear them out, clear them out, clear them out. Okay. So whatever, try that again, apply it. So whatever port I program the motor in, the two pin motor, I put my motor here. And it is a VEX 393 motor. I apply it, I okay it. I must do a quick refresh of my screen, hit cancel to make that motor show up. Steve and Steve. Speeds, um, it goes from speeds of zero up to speeds of 129, and that's just rotations per minute. But I found as the batteries have gotten older over the years, speeds less than 30 don't really make the motor turn. So I'd maybe make go 30 at the lowest. So here it is, start motor, Steve, this speed, Steve runs for five, five seconds, Steve stops. Plug the orange cord in my computer USB port, plug the orange cord in my robot, I push down on the robot, and I push the start button, and the program should work. Um, if the program doesn't work, with the orange cord plugged in, do the download firmware. When it's done, hit OK, and try it again. And good luck on port one.